This week on 3D Archery, we're at the Saugerties Fishing Game in Saugerties, New York. Hey everybody, Greg here. Welcome back to 3D Archery. This week we're in Saugerties, New York at the Saugerties Fish and Game as you heard in the intro. And I'm shooting with Jeff and I have a guy, Todd, coming with us. You're going to meet him in a minute. He met me through Facebook. He asked if he can shoot with us. It's going to be a great day. Beautiful, a little chilly, a little bit of wind, but we're getting closer to that all-important summertime. So kick back and enjoy the three of us at the Saugerties Fish and Game Club. Good news, bad news. Good news is it's a cool looking shot. Bad news is that racks right in my projector. First shot of the day. Nice job. I gripped it and ripped it. <laughs> nice. nice shot. Look at that in line and high. Oh, wow, good shot. I cut it out to just a really shot. Short. Right. Ooh. You can hit the target. These are all in the twenties. Ooh, Ooh I baby. ripped and gripped. He didn't rip and grit. The animal no, jumped no, string. No, it it jumped. ducked the string. Yeah, that's a fiber. There, there you that's go. That's where it should be. Hi, mom. All right, twenty something yards. We know the bullseye is generally in that V area. Well, you were there. Oh, I didn't say that. I won't look at it. Right by yours. <laughs> Way back. <laughs> Not a fresh. It's more than 20. Oh, yeah. That's about a 23 or 25. Focus on your basics. That's all you got to do, bud. You got it. Oh, jugular. Actually, now you. We're like little fans. We get excited about a cool looking shot. Now that is awesome. I think that's awesome. Guts. Nice one. Guts. Got an eight. Shot the guts. You shoot between the trees? Yeah. I can't stay on the stake. Oh, no. 20 plus yards. Excuses. What does that mean, Greg? Nothing. Oh, and I went wide left. I blew it. Really? Well, 10 yards. 10 yards, I'm really low. Dang it. I can see the 10, but I missed it. You're about two inches? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Nice one. Oh, You're just on the top. So if you put yours in between ours, okay. slightly to the right. Oh, I gotta move it to the right also? Yeah, look at this. You'll see it. I can see the, uh -huh. the ring. Ah, yes. Just over your fletching. That's yeah, my fletching's always in the way. Just over it.
Oh! Right. Nice line. Yeah, there's that little window. 20 yards. That seems to be their favorite number here. In your head, you think you're holding. Step shot at him. There you go. I was shooting at my arrow, huh? That's what we tend to do. <laughs> well. Can't see it, but it's a bear down there. Of course, but we're one of the fans. That's better. Woohoo! Don't have to go looking. Oh, look at that. That was a good one. I like that one. It's only like 15 yards. 13 maybe. Ooh. You know I don't like these shots this close. Bambi's pretty damn stupid let me get this close to him. Especially with us talking. When I talk myself through it, I shoot much better. <laughs> that would be a nice shot from farther back. Shoulders. Yeah. That's why you got to learn to shoot from different stances, Jeff. <laughs> nice one. You know what the funny part of that was? I could tell your arrow was going to go there before you even let it go. It just looks like it lined up. Once again, sub 20, 10 to 15, got to go about a foot. Nice. Right in there. You got plenty did of you parts see what there. I did? I did my Jeff Krug rotational draw. Oh, I love it actually. When I, when I remember to do it, that locks my shoulder in. Attributed to Arn Mo. I follow I Arn Mo. I'll, I'm subscribed to him. Do that again. Come on, don't worry about the camera. So I want you to do this draw a little slower, don't draw so fast. Nice. That, that'll Ten be yards, baby. Well, coming from the compound world, that looks much more natural having your hand in that position. Well, yeah, it doesn't feel it when you get your thumb wrapped up. Just a little low. I was exactly in line. Dang it. A little high. It, but I'm happy with that. All right, Todd. Take her out. That's hilarious. Not bad. You got him. We don't have to go look at Oh, I totally blew that one. 
so watch this stuff. It'll look cool. Ah, oh, I should have not made the faces. They won't know on the downrange camera. All right, I've been told by an expert quiver builder, my quiver is a poor design. It's made out of PVC for one dude. He says it's not natural for me to do that right there. Okay, needs a bigger mouth. Some people tell me I got too big of a mouth, but hey. All right, yeah, you're right, this is more than 20. Not a whole lot. A little high, a little high. But it's because my quiver was the wrong size and I'm obsessing over it. A little low, a little low. A little low, not bad. Yeah. All right, Todd, you got it. Bring home. Not bad. Fifteen yards. I'm gonna put the arrow right in the shadow leaf. Ho! Oh. Sometimes I, when I figure it out, actually I just made that all up as I went. I just know at about 15 I got to be a foot down. So I figured it's six inches to the bottom of his belly, six inches to the ground. Oh, look at that. Look at this. It's going to be hard. I know. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Another 10-yarder, and put my arrow, face the boat, Ooh, a little wide, a little wide. So you're getting lost, that's what it does to you. I lost my gap. Nice one. Right. Ooh, a little high. Closer than I thought then. All right, everybody, that was the first half of the course. We think it's the first half of the course because we were talking a little bit and sort of got lost and ran into people and they told us, no, those aren't those. So the good news is we think we're back on track and I did miss, but it was one of the ones that we messed up on. So don't believe Jeff. So I didn't actually miss yet. So here we are, the second half. All right, we, well, we're pretty sure it's the second half, but let's see what we do now. All right, deer, 20 yards. I'm gonna put it pretty much a little low. Wow! A little high? Yeah! It's a pill. That it's less than 20 then. Holy Moses! As long as it looks good in the video. Oh! Where is it? I see On his shoulder. Wow, the heck did I do there? Crap! I need a better video than that. I gotta get it. But Todd can do it for us. <laughs> Ooh, 
Ooh, that was worse. No, I had on. Try to shoot. Nice. Once again, a lot closer to Hank. That's where I wanted it. Let's hope that's where the bullseye is. Here we are at target 17. Now, you see the wolf, but our stake is on about six to eight feet below me on the edge of a cliff. And it's probably two yards closer, but I like the, the angle. So I'm gonna blow this. So if I do blow it, I'll just say it was a fun shot and I didn't score it. Ah, right, Mr. Quixote. That's a wolf, actually. Wait, wait, wait. What are we waiting for? Finals to find out where the bullseye is. It doesn't help. You're not supposed to do it on the stake. Don't My cheap, I'm not on the stake. <laughs> Good point. <laughs> My cheap finals that I found in my drawer. <laughs> All right. I think where that little V in the brown is where I want to hit. So I'm going to put it on the bottom of his belly. Nice. Very nice. Yeah, a little low. Should have came up a little higher. Didn't go on the bottom of his belly, went just oh, below look it. Look at that. I doubted my Ooh, shot. Just, a little, just over your, another one, just over your fletching out. Golden. No, baby. All right, Todd, it's up to you to put it right alongside ours. Up there. Do the trifecta, just stare at our arrows. <laughs> just, wait a minute. Just stare at it like it owes you money. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, that's what that guy said. That's right. Oh. Dude, that knock came all the way back to us. Okay, target 18 here at Saugerties. The toughest and one of the coolest shots ever. See the zoom in? We gotta miss the bow rack, but it is way uphill. We are on top of a cliff. There's the stake and there's the target. This is not easy. All right, this is a good distance. And it's a good 15, 20 foot cliff. I'll show you the steps here in a minute. I am gonna go point on. Woo, baby. Yeah! Boom! I got him good too. Might have got a 10. Yeah! Yo-ho! Wait, wait. Don't get emotional. And I'm gonna cry. <laughs> You're trying to hit Todd's arrow. What?
I think they should have an escalator for us older people. That's the one we're missing. Shots here are no joke. 23 yards at least. Not a quarter, it's an eighth. Look what's all behind it. What am I gonna do? I'm gonna put an arrow with very little feathering on it. I'm gonna go spot on. Whoa! Thank you. You gotta take your shot. I, when I let it go, I was like, oh, too low, too low, too low. <laughs> Jeff, not, don't shoot at my arrow, oh, dang I it. I shouldn't have done that. I should have went. All right, boys and girls, we're at target 20. One thing, you notice I quit using the GoPro? Both batteries died. Note to GoPro, your batteries suck. All right, improve them, please, I beg you. I will buy more batteries so it doesn't happen. This next one, we got trees all along us, stakes over here. Let's see what happens. I can't even find it. And again, I can't even see where the damn X is, or the bullseye. Little low, little low. Yo, oh, nice shot. Target 21 is the wolf, right there in the corner. And the next one we gotta go down and shoot by the wolf at the bear. You know that ain't happening. But if I miss, I'm not gonna count it. <laughs> What's that? Oh, I'm still running, damn it. Hold on, hold on Dude, this is like. Give me a sec, give me a sec, I'm screwing up That's here. okay, More this is usual. like real close. Holy Moses. All right, all right. I am gonna put my arrow at the base of his feet because that's what it feels like I should do. Yeah, all right, what it felt was right. I didn't hold it long and do it right. i let you guys take a shot at him. I just don't understand. I wonder what, how much of an angle that was. It felt like a 45. Ooh, jugular. Oh, there's the wolfie. It must be a beautiful shot of you. He's close. Ooh, miss! Bastard. He ducked the string. Bastard. Gotta back up. Gotta <laughs> get more distance. Well, that's, and that's cheating. Yeah, screw it. I'm shooting again. We're having fun. Doesn't matter. Hmm. Hmm. He's looking at me funny. Got him in the ear. Target 21. The stake is down by the wolf we just shot at. You can see the bear out in the distance. Hey. Yes! Field goal, $1,000, thank you very much. Shot him a little high. 
Because I aimed high. I was supposed to aim low. But it's dead center. Dead center where I wanted. Nice shot. And you clipped the branch. I heard that. You can see it flopping around still. That's where I... am running around going, I'm missing arrows. We measured them to 98 yards. Okay. <laughs> oh. Gee, where were you holding? <laughs> I was actually hanging where I, where I hit. I aimed high and I should have aimed low. Aimed high. It's not as far, it's only 33 yards. Oh, I was gonna aim at the camera. Back of the head. Remember, my point's a little lower than yours. But it, mine went a lot lower than I thought, or higher than I thought. That's wow. where I was aiming. I told you, see, the same thing happened to me. This is the perfect angle to affect the internal ballistics. All right, let me re-ballisticize. I'll shoot at that arrow. Wait a minute. Again. Here. Do I have another one for the white ones? Yeah, keep going. There you go. All right, Jeff. Ooh. Work the Katra, baby. Katra, Katra. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty good. <laughs> it works. <laughs> Well, it's not where I wanted it, but it flew nice. It's good from here. Yeah, but it's a quarter shot. I think I only got five. Yeah, I only got five. Yeah. I'm not even close to the target. Especially with my internal ballistics to vibrate. And I heard it liquefies the organs when you hit them. <laughs> nice! Look at that. That could be okay. that's close to a 10 right there. That's those hydrostatic shocks going on. So you see that little ray of sunshine? That's where I think the bullseye is in that little gap. Bend your right. Or just, just a hair to the left of it. Yes, just a little to the left. That, oh, there. I think that's it. A little, little low, but. Right there, that little tree. 18 yards. First miss. Well, at full draw, I shifted my stupid anchor. Yeah, so I think it's farther than 18 then. My call was really bad. I don't know why. Well, I'm, I'm gonna repeat it then. I'm, I'm going with this the hair under 20. Yeah, that's what I thought too. Well, I made up for the other miss with this miss. So I'm just gonna stare at it like it owes me money. That's what I did. You owe me, you owe me kitty. Ooh, that wouldn't be so good, hey? <laughs> Pay attention to the arrow rest, not the steering kitty down. Nice. That's a 10. With ease. With ease. Far off that tree That's what I said. That was the hard part for me, was right on that tree. Todd's going to show us how it's done in the hood. Nice! Nice! See? Yeah! All right. Nice!
Nice. Oh, my GoPro died. And you were gonna hit the bullseye. Nice a little high. Take it. It'll look good in the video. That's all I. Can. <laughs> nice. One dead deer, baby. Deer. Yeah, we shot this before. I remember hitting this tree. A little low, but I crept in. Yeah, it's that tree. That's how I remember. Not bad. That was cool. Let's try that again. That was on the bottom of the belly. Wow, I got my first miss of the day. Good shot. Nice. Good shot. Man, that would have been pretty if I had the yellow arrow. I don't have a straight shooting arrow. That one even went high. See? Todd's coming on fire. Last target of the day. This takes over here, off the side. As you can see, there's two trees. And you know me, 
I gotta try to split them. Take one. Take one. Now there's a lot of gap. Back there, there's not. You look about that far apart. No, there's a big gap. There's a lot of gap. Nice. That's real nice. All right, everybody, there's the course. Now, let me tell you. First one, first half of the course is fine. Station four is really cool. That was a really cool shot hanging off the, uh, or sitting out on the island in the swamp. I shot a 122 in the first half. I was doing good, All right? I thought it was the first half. Jeff, what do you think about the first half? First half was a very fun course. I loved weaving in and out of things, the shots, the branches, quartering away, quartering towards. We really like this type of uh, layout in a course. You know, that's funny because even out on the course, he started saying that. He's like, now this, this is a course. And that's what it is. I know you guys think we're talking bad, but here's the best part. I'm saying this and I believe it. The second half is a world-class 3D archery course. You will not find funner, more challenging shots in the second half. All right? Okay, yeah, we got lost in the first half. <laughs> but the second half, and I shot a 96 in the second half. I had two misses. Bozo misses. I made all the hard shots. I made the easy ones. Now, the buck from on top of the cliff shooting down and the bow rack was sticking out blocking the target. Oh, that's not right. Yeah, that's not right, but that made it so hard. And we all made it. We shot well. The wolf. The wolf was one of the coolest ones. They out, I'm telling you, the second half. Just come for that one. And picturesque. Don't yeah. forget picturesque. You'll see it in the video or you already have seen it. <laughs> I already have seen it. Oh, okay. <laughs> Now, this is uh, April. We got to come back in the summer to see what this thing's like in the summer. The guys inside told us that people were complaining about too many broadsides, which, you know, if you watch my videos, I complain about that too. That wolf, that wasn't a quartering, that was an eighth. That was a challenging shot. You know, had a great time. So if you're in here, you think you got skill or you like to be challenged, if you're one of those little guys that want the, the broadside shots, don't come here. Stay away. We don't like you anyways. But if you guy wants to shoot, you Just want a challenge, alienate come here to Saugerties. <laughs> Just alienate all you. <laughs> well, <laughs> the guy from Uzbekistan, <laughs> however you shoot, I'm happy to have you as a subscriber. Please don't unsubscribe my person from Uzbekistan. <laughs> all right. Anything else? That's about it. Wonderful I'm, course. Wonderful day. Uh, 30 targets, $15. Can't beat it. Saugerties fishing game. All right, boys and girls, you know the deal. If you liked the video, give us a thumbs up. If you didn't, give us a thumbs down or keep it to yourself. You got a question or comment, put it in the comments down below. Don't forget to support us on Patreon for the Sam Sage giveaway, and we'll see you next week with an all-new episode, 3D Archery.